have a pet, maybe this will give you instructions on how to do the watercolor of your pet. Hi, uh, Wayne White Watercolors here. I'm, a, I'm uh, planning on doing another uh, portrait of a dog into the into the uh, pet mode. Have a pet, maybe this will give you instructions on how to do a watercolor of your pet. Uh, this is one I, 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 I did recently of a, of a bulldog, and uh, and now I'm going to uh, set that over there. Now I'm going to do a painting of a beagle. This is the photo. I've done, a, I've done my pencil drawing. Oh, and, it's, and instead of winning the front and back of the paper to keep from buckling, but this time I'm just going to clip the edge of the papers to keep it from, from buckling. This is my drawing, and I, and I think I color. I'm going to use, I'm going to use a, uh, a raw sienna. The dog in the cartoon is a beagle. So I base color down. I mean, another guide. And I, I want to leave. Dogs for a coat is. It's rather a hard day, rather a hot day here in Walnut Creek, California. But we're, we're doing this well. We're not yet into the 90s, but we will be. I'm not doing the full dog. I'm doing a, a, a portrait of the dog. Fully white on his chest. It's not a hot day like this. The paint is growing very, very fast. Put in the darkest darks, which is the the, sh the deep shadows. Burnt, um, burnt umber.
I'm doing, I'm doing the, um, the very fine things to take time. Tell me, and also hitting the darkest dark areas. Paper I'm using um, is 140 pound watercolor paper. It's between a cold press and a hot press. Kind of a, a hybrid. I'm doing this because, and it's not the kind I use for landscapes, but I, I like this for doing what I'm doing, painting a pet, because can, uh, I, I, uh, I can um, smooth out the paint much easier. It, it this sink into the paper as, as much as my uh, my arts is. 140 pound watercolor paper does. Bring, bring this shadow down for one thing. <clears throat> and after a few days, I'll look at my painting again and I need to do. If you have a, but I hope you give this a try and try your luck at painting your pet. Remember, uh, 40 pound watercolor paper. You might try a hot press, which is very smooth. It's much easier to, ma to manipulate the paint in real. Or if not that, a, a, hundred, uh, a, a, cold, a cold press that's, that, that's, that's not very rough. Cold press, but it's. It's, it's, it's not as uh, rough as, as most whole, uh, cold pressed papers. Sometime this week I'll, I'll finish it. Maybe I'll, I'll finish it in my studio where it's not so hot. So long till now and watch again.